Okay, guys, I said I was going to quit this. I, I saw it today, and I'm like, you know, let's just do one more cut and see what we got. So where did we go to, and where did we go from? Let's calculate it up. Okay, it doesn't sound right, but it feels bigger than that. But we went from 87.8, 88.7, sorry, to 89.8. Bigger, bowl, laid back, short side radius, loser. Well, it gives you an idea where we're going tonight. I had to do a lot more work to it because the throat was getting way big and the top of the bowl's looking quite narrow. So I had to take some area out of the bowl, both sides, work on the short side because we changed the amount of overhang on that short side by quite a lot. So right now we're, you know, very close to 90%, which all the experts say is where you want to be. Let's take a look at it. Okay, short side had a lot of metal taken out. It was widened, it was laid back, and its radius this way has been taken out quite a bit. You would think that would help a huge amount. Let's take a look. Okay, so... This is, this is what we had, this is where we are. Let's do some pluses and minuses. Okay, as you can see, minus, 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 loser. Guess what? The one before was a loser. This, I think, was our best one, 87.8. I think this was our best one. A little bigger than I like it. I usually like it around 86%. But it's also a completely different... It's a different design uh, short side. Matter of fact, I actually drew over my curves. One of those curves is the Dart SS. And the other one is this throttle body injection. The one on top is a throttle body injection. It's hard to see, but the... Oh, you know what? I have the, I have them bent on a piece of solder. Okay, right about there. If you take a look at that line, that's where our valve seat is. And that's the shape of our short side on the TBI. Now, that is after it's been modified. That was right about uh, our winner. I think it was around 87.8. I took that uh, mold of it. Okay, that is our Dart SS. Notice it's a complete departure. Completely different. Totally much, much higher. The whole port is really relatively straight and then makes its 90. It's, it's a, a much better design. Now remember, the reason I'm even doing all this is I have I have the darts pretty much done, but the exhaust short side. You know what? Let's compare what we got to what we have on the darts. All right, we'll see if we can get some decent pictures of this. It ain't gonna be easy though. My focus is giving me trouble. Okay, that is your throttle body ejection. Really doesn't look bad. Hopefully you guys can see how much taller that short side is, right? Now you can see it's got some polishing on it. And by the seat, it's still a little rough. I may polish all that out if it, if it makes a difference. But I'm not going to do anything until the new foray has come in and I do a little testing. Customer sent me pictures of it. It looks like the foray is coming through with a little bit of a tulip. That might work out really, really well with that deep that deep venturi bowl that this has that may work out really well so i'm kind of excited to see that i mean i would like to keep these i would like to keep these relatively tight All right, if you take a look at that versus that they're both 1.6s okay that's almost a 90 percent throat it's like an 80 percent throat you can tell it's tiny look at how how far the the short side comes into the port Okay, it's kind of a mess comparing 
this loser one to this loser one as far as air speeds. Since we lost everywhere, we would figure our air speeds took a beating. So let's take a look. That's these numbers versus these numbers. Let me put some pluses and minuses in. Okay, this side of the port. Plus, we got a nice gain right on the roof. Minus, minus. Okay, not nearly, not nearly as even from top to bottom. Center of the port. 312, 312 equals. 316 to 270. Ouch, that's a huge drop. Okay. 284, which is a great speed on the floor. 264. Even though it has more of a laid back floor, you would figure more air would go on that. Obviously not. Now this one, I ran out of room, so this is what we had. This is what we have. Minus, minus, a little bit added on the floor. Pretty much a loser all the way around. All right, guys. I don't know whether you want me to go any further on that. That port is about minimum, minimum thickness. It's minimum thickness right about here. It's pushed about as hard as I would push it and actually drive it. Uh, you might be able to get away with a little thinner than that if it was a strictly a racing thing. I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't like putting in that many hours and worrying about stuff cracking. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out. Have a good night.